Hey everybody, this is Chaos from Chaos and Divine Feminine, and welcome to my channel. This is going to be a full moon all signs reading of my very first all signs, so I'm a little bit excited. Um, please like, comment, and subscribe so that you can uh, follow the channel and help the channel grow and see what else I got coming up next. All right, so I'm going to start from Aries and go all the way down. Um, Let's see what's going on this full moon. Girls Need Love is playing right now. So, Aries. Let me get the current energy for Aries. Oh, shit. Okay, so got justice at the bottom of the deck. Queen of Wands in um, reverse. The Empress is the Empress is here. Temperance, the Five of Cups, Queen of Wands in reverse. So somebody here is not feeling themselves right now. It's a Empress here not feeling herself. Someone is down. Why are you down? What's going on? Knight of Cups. You could be, there's a lot of Leo energy here. The, um, the two, I'm sorry, strength card and the sun is here. And then we got the Queen of Wands in reverse, which is also Leo, but it's in reverse. So maybe Aquarius, the World card. Okay, so someone's been lying to you, but you know the truth, but they don't know you know the truth. Tell me about this Queen of Wands in reverse. <clears throat> okay, so the Ten of Swords in reverse landed on the Five of Cups. And then the Emperor. The Emperor, I think this is, is this Taurus energy. This emperor is causing Someone is making you feel like shit I hope you're not in an abusive relationship If you are It's time to get out of that This emperor is Making an empress is an abusive ass person here. What in the world? Um, yeah, it's someone. You lost your, um, you lost yourself in an abusive ass, toxic ass relationship. He cheats on you, degrades you, 
talks about you. Okay. I see the Eight of Cups, so, and the Star, so, and the Queen of Swords, okay. All right, so maybe you are going to walk away. Good, because what the fuck? I don't like that, man. This is not a good start. It's the full moon. What the fuck? Okay, let's move on to uh to Taurus. Because that just brought me down a little bit. <laughs> Spirit guides, please give me a um, current energy for, for Taurus. Current energy for Taurus. I saw the Ace of Swords, so somebody seeking some truth in a in in a little drama filled situation. Cause I just saw the Five of Wands. Taurus. Someone standing their grounds. Standing their ground on a situation. The lovers. What is going on with these lying ass people? Who's who's lying? Okay, we got the seven of swords and the justice card. Hmm. the moon at the bottom okay so maybe you're talking to somebody okay tell me about this justice card the torch please spirit that's the second time. Okay. The uh, Seven of Cups came out. I had a... Okay. I, I knew it. All right. Because I saw that twice already. You're about to get justice in the situation. What's the situation? You trying to work with somebody? An empress landed on Tell me about this. Tell me about this empress. Oh. The death card landed on the four of cups. The hair of What is this about? Um, someone, okay, this is work related. Someone took credit for, it's an empress here. She took credit for someone else's idea. But, um, but wait. So what about, okay, tell me about the seven of wands, I mean the seven of cups, the hangman, justice, seven of cups, and the hangman. Okay, it looks like, oh, okay. This person is finna okay, so yeah, there this she she gonna get her karma. She's gonna get her justice. She's gonna lose a lot. They're gonna somebody somehow is gonna come out that she stole credit for your idea and it's gonna cause 
her to lose out on a lot, lot of opportunities. Yeah, we got the uh, Four of Cups with the Death card. The Hanged Man. Okay, that makes sense. So, Taurus. Oh, yep, the Tower. So, this, yeah. And then the Ten of Pentacles at the bottom. So, you're going to come out on top. The Emperor. Okay, so this might be a male energy. Hmm. It's a group of people working with her that did this. But it's going to be good. King of Swords. Yep. Someone's going to see through the bullshit and figure it out. And it looks like a boss. Someone over over this one person is going to figure it out. And they're going to, yeah. It's going to work out. You'll be all right. I feel like them opportunities that she's going to fuck up for herself are going to go to you, Taurus, okay? All right, so Gemini. Let's get Gemini spirit. Somebody might have been left out in the cold. Someone's really thinking about, okay, this could be a relationship. Someone's thinking about the effort they put in to something after being left in the cold. Gemini, please, spirit. Oh, shit. Too many cards. That was a lot of cards. But I do see an opportunity, a new opportunity, headed your way. I hope y'all didn't see my butt. Because my dress just came up. <sighs> oh my gosh. I hope y'all didn't see my butt. For real. Okay. Gemini. Something might be getting illuminated soon. Hard find tried to come out. The King of Wands. Did something flip over? Nope. King of Wands. Current energy this new moon. See? Ace Pentacles came back out again. I said that y'all have a new opportunity coming up. Oh, what the hell? Okay. What is this about? Because <laughs> there's already two men here. One of them's lying about something. I did see the moon card, so I expect that to come back out. The Queen of Swords. Okay, so you you ain't dumb. You okay. Ace of Cups, Queen of Swords, Queen of Wands at the bottom. You might end up single after whatever this is. You might end up happier single because I saw the Ten of Cups and the Nine of Pentacles. Okay. Tell me about this Ace of Cups. The Two of Pentacles landed on the Ace of Pentacles. And then the Five of Cups landed on... What? Those are like... Contradictive as fuck. What? Clarify this Five of Cups. Something was hidden. Something, like I said, okay, so the moon card ended up coming out, like I said it would. <laughs> Something is, isn't. I'm tired of these cards flying everywhere. Okay, that, okay, good. Now I know y'all didn't see my ass earlier. 
the wheel of fortune okay so maybe this king of wands is the liar what i saw earlier seven of wands uh, seven of swords earlier because the wheel of fortune landed on them that motherfucker's time is up we still got a king of, of cups here what's up with this king of cups spirit the sun and okay so it looks like this king of cups is a better investment here yeah y'all have mutual feelings for each other what about what's what about this uh asa i mean this okay so oh okay so this eight this ace of pentacles and this uh, two of Pentacles, the Empress landed. So this offer is going to be what brings you balance with this King of Cups. Could be a water sign or a fire sign. Yeah, okay. So, yeah. Looks like you already know which one is which. All right, uh, Cancer. Give me trust that Jesus is on. Cancer by Bryson Tiller. Yes, yeah, it's, it's the one that I'm thinking. Trust issues by Bry Bryson Tiller is playing right now for Cancer. Give me a. Uh, Message for cancer, please. This full moon, enter this full moon energy spirit. Oh, okay. You guarding your money from a, a queen of wands. So, is this a male cancer? Strength card. Cancer, please. Oh, what's this? This landed across. Okay. That landed across that. Like that. Okay, so you're. You're leaving behind drama with this Queen of Wands. Yep. Looks like a twin flame karmic that you're you're ghosting or leaving out in the cold. Yeah, you you're you're over you're over a twin flame karmic and you're walking away. But it looks like this must be a married couple. Yeah, oh, okay. So Get your proof together, because I feel like this is in regards to a divorce. Okay. You're moving towards a Ten of Cups, for sure. So that's, that makes sense as far as guarding your money, guarding your pentacles. Uh, okay. So you're trying, to, uh, you're trying to do this in a way that causes the least amount of drama, because this Queen of Wands is, she likes to be seen. This is some, you're trying not to have it be some messy ass shit. And you know, you're trying, you know, she's finna try and take you for, okay. So you, you got, I think you have what you need though. Cause you must've caught somebody cheating or something. So you have your proof that's going to help you make sure that this bitch don't take you for all you got. What's going to be the outcome for this for cancer spirit? What's the outcome? Okay, nine of cups and the three of cups in reverse. You high priestess and death. Okay, and the hanged man. Okay. You're gonna end. You're gonna end up having a peaceful resolution to your surprise. Let's see. 
yeah, you're not going to expect to have this peaceful of a resolution, but it's going to be, it's going to be all right, Cancer. You'll get through it because it looks like you are, you already know what you're doing. I saw the uh, high priestess, so you know exactly what you need to do. All right, Leo. Leo. I'm a Leo. I keep seeing the uh, Nine of Pentacles. Trust issues is still on. Uh, Cancer, that also explains the trust issues song. Leo, please, spirit. This full moon energy for Leo. Somebody's in their head about some shit. Like, losing sleep over something. Someone is in a fucking mental prison. Over a twin flame issue. Another twin flame issue. Who else did we do twin flame? Three of cups, king of pentacles. Six of pentacles. Two of cups came back out again. So it is a twin flame. The ace of cups landed sideways over the two of cups and then we got the five of swords and the moon here so it looks like this is a relationship that has run its course because we got the will of fortune on the bottom seven of wands and the death card i did see a um i did see the ten of cups so overall things are going to work out what else for leo yes yeah, uh whoever this is that with the Ace of Cups sideways. See, this Knight is even coming in in Cricket. <laughs> this Knight of Cups is coming in on some bullshit. Because they Cricket to the motherfucker right now. Which explains ugh, the Seven of Swords. Leo, you at the bottom of the deck. Nine of Cups. Queen of Wands. Again, Leo energy. Uh, nine of Wands, the Fool. Okay, you're going to walk away. And you're going to end up walking into Ten of Pentacles. It looked like Leo's going to be just about their money. Yeah. Okay. Chariot, moving forward. Hanged Man, the World card. Yeah, you done with this. Whoever this is that's trying to come in with this crooked-ass offer, hide, lying, hiding shit. You'll be all right. Okay. Virgo. Virgo, Virgo, Virgo. Spirit, give me the current energy for this full moon. This I already see somebody not accept, like, somebody is ungrateful. It might be an empress, an ungrateful-ass, spoiled-ass empress who... Think she's an empress, but she ain't shit. Judgment. Virgo spirit. You working on something. Lovers at the bottom. Any energy for Virgo, please, spirit. Energy for Virgo, please, Spirit. Yep, the devil. You got almost the same cards as Cancer. Was that Cancer? You must be dealing with the Cancer, Virgo. Um, Because it's the devil. And what did I just say? <laughs> okay. The towers at the bottom. Yeah, you might be dealing with a, a cancer. So this is the other half. And also remember flip however it's supposed to be. Years Go By is the song by Bryson Tiller. I don't know that song. Um, 
What is that? Oh. The magician. See, yeah, you're working on something. You're working on an offer. You're moving in very slowly towards a twin flame. You're moving towards your wish fulfillment. A high priestess. You're going for it with an offer. Let's see. Clarify this uh, devil card, please. Spirit. Oh. The Hierophant. Temperance. Oh, judgment and the hanged man. For the devil, higher font. You're not listening to your spirit guides. And you're getting your ass whooped for it. You're... Spirit's trying to guide you, and you're fucking up, and you're getting your ass whooped. Your ego is in the way. Three of Wands in reverse, Queen of Cups. Okay, this Ten of Pentacles. Okay, the Queen of Cups landed on this Ten of Pentacles and this Four of Pentacles. The sun's at the bottom of the deck. Might be a Leo. See, yep, the Leo. Okay, Queen of Cups might be a Leo. Because it's clarified by the Strength card. Somebody's in their head. Somebody is stressed, depressed. Somebody's walking away. The Hermit in reverse. Wait a minute. Okay. So the Five of Pentacles is in reverse. Oh. Clarify. So this Three of Wands in reverse. Let's clarify this Eight of Swords. Upright. You're not overcoming something. And I think it ties into... You're not... You're moving out of ego. You've lost a lot. You've missed out on a lot of opportunities. The tower. I see what you want. You want happiness... Love. You want you want the truth with the Queen of Swords. So you can move forward and start a new cycle. But you're still you haven't changed. There's still you still are you are still moving and operating out of ego with this Ten of Pentacles and this Seven of Cups. The Empress. Whoever this is, it's a cycle. It's just doing the same over and over again. You work towards something, then boom, tower. You make another offer. You want... Okay, you see, you want... You want the truth to come out, mutual feelings, offers made, and then all of a sudden, boom. Lies and heartbreak in your head. You're you're <laughs> you're causing yourself to repeat a cycle over and over again. You're literally torturing yourself. Y'all ever seen American Horror Story when, um, when, um, 
what's her name got sent to hell and she had to keep dissecting the frog over and over again and it was just torture that's what you're doing you're just you're you're causing your own hell what are you doing virgo come on now okay um scorpio Scorpio spirit. Give me the current full moon energy of Scorpio, please. See the sun card. Misty Day. When Misty Day went and was stuck in hell and she kept having to dissect the frog over and over again and she was crying because she likes to bring shit back to life and she had to keep killing innocent yeah you going through the same hell over and over again virgo you tripping because i feel like you could change it if you wanted to okay scorpio 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 spirit uh the page of wands in reverse that one just kind of hopped out the moon Scorpio, justice. Wait a minute, because I want to see what this is. Um, okay. Uh, Stay ready. What a life by Janae Aiko. Okay, so the moon card is clarified by the Ten of Cups. So I guess that's what you don't see. Oh, yeah, the magician's at the bottom of the deck. You're manifesting. What you don't see, Scorpio, is that you're, you're manifesting your soulmate. And you are about to get good karmic justice. See, you, you, <laughs> the high priestess and the, uh, okay. So, yeah, the, you, this, the moon, you don't see this. You're doubting that it's never going to happen. Scorpio, you feel like it's never going to happen, but the justice card is here. Spirit is going to give you what you don't see coming. Like, you're going to have options. And then one of those options, you probably have several soulmates. So any of the options are going to be good. Yeah, Ten of Pentacles. Okay, this is a good one. What is this? Okay, so you're walking away from, you've been in hermit mode. You've been isolated, healing yourself. Okay, you've been healing yourself. This is somebody, you're someone spiritual. Okay, so you must be, you must have been going on a spiritual journey and all that good stuff, celibacy and this and that. So yeah, you got your, uh, you got your wish fulfillment on the way. You got love coming. I think it's going to be someone that you don't expect. You're going to be like, what the fuck? Are you serious, spirit? It's cool, but what? I feel like it's going to be like something like that. Okay. Um, Capricorn. No, no. Scorpio. Sagittarius. Sorry, Sagittarius. Sagittarius. See, you know, what a life. Yeah, you finna have a good life. What a life. Sagittarius. Spirit, give me the current energy for Sagittarius. Oh, this is a freaky sign. Sagittarius, you got some freak shit tonight. This is Paris, Who Taught You uh, by Jeremiah. Who taught you that? Yeah. That's a freaky ass song. I like that song. Um, the full, uh, okay, uh, strength is at the bottom. Queen of Cups landed on, so you finna uh, give this Queen of Cups her flowers. You finna step out on, okay, so you finna step out on, uh, on Faith with a Queen of Cups. Okay, that didn't pop out. King of Wands.
King of Wands with the Knight of Swords in reverse. The Empress at the bottom of the deck. Okay, so you might have more than one person here. Um... Movement. Clarify okay, the two of. See, the Empress wants to come out. The Sun and the Empress. How are you going to give your flowers? To this queen of cup but that's not she's not the only one you got eyes for you got an empress here and a queen of pentacles what Sagittarius what's up with this two of swords see yeah two of swords please two of swords please. are you gonna tell me about the two of swords see This Knight of Cups is upside down, is in reverse over this Queen of Cups. And then the Three of Cups is over this King of Wands. This King Dingling. You might not want to mess with one of these women. Because. You're going to leave one of them out in the cold. Okay, so, so you're going to you're going to end up making a choice. And whatever you choose, you're going to get a 10 of cups. Oh, this is a soulmate. Except for, I feel like you're still not going to be completely honest. There's shit that you're going to be hiding. The death card. And that's on this um, Queen of Cups. Okay, so maybe you're going to end it with this Queen of Cups. And you're going to like let her down nicely. Okay. Oh, okay. So you no longer have eyes for this Queen of Cups. And you're giving her flowers. Because you don't want to... It's not a fucked up situation. And maybe y'all just grew apart. So... But still... You're moving slowly. No matter... Either way, you're... You're you're, you're not making any sudden moves. You're taking your time with the shit. Whatever this is, you're taking your time with it. I still want to know what's up with this Two of Swords. The moon. Okay, Sag. <laughs> I don't think you fully know what you want. You have an idea. You have a game plan in your head. But you don't know if that's really what you want to do. You ain't doing shit right now. You acting like you you, you want to do something. You're like It's like you're amping, it, amping yourself up in your head. and it, But then you're not doing shit. I don't know. Okay. Capricorn. Capricorn, Impatient by Jeremiah and Tadala Sign. Capricorn. What's current energy for Capricorn? Somebody's deceitful. Somebody's hiding shit and lying. And then we got the lion. <laughs> the strength card. Okay. Capricorn, please, spirit. Two of cups at the bottom of the deck. Strength card came out anyways. Okay, so...
That's too many cards. How did those flip over like that? Okay, anyway. Somebody, somebody's getting a divorce. King of Wands in reverse. Somebody might be getting a divorce. Uh, Capricorn. Yeah, somebody's walking away from a marriage. Um, you've taken inventory. You, you thought about. Excuse me. You've thought about everything you've invested in this relationship, and looks like you're cutting your losses and you're moving on. We got the marriage card in reverse, reverse, six of cups in reverse, uh, three of wands in reverse, the five of pentacles, yeah. Okay, the devil at the bottom. Okay, uh, Capricorn and then Aquarius. Aquarius spirit give me a clear reading for Aquarius neither do I STWO featuring Jeremiah I don't know this song oh sounds good I can't really hear it but okay Aquarius I see the chariot so you moving away from something because I saw the death card or moving into something new one of the two Aquarius please spirit chariot still coming out you moving away from a lion ass bitch or a lion ass nigga Three cups at the bottom of the deck. Okay, maybe you're changing your ways. You're moving away from your own deceitful ways. <laughs> okay, so it looks like you must have uh, listened to karma. Not karma. Uh, the sun. Moon tower. Yeah. You went through something. And now it's changed your perspective. You're changing your ways. You've come into some sort of judgment because we got the Seven of Swords in reverse. In the Chariot and the Ace of Cups, the Sun at the bottom, the Moon at the bottom, and the Tower. And the Eight of Wands. And there's nobody here. So I feel like this is you. You've hit the ultimate Tower moment to where after self-reflection... So the... This must have been your lesson for the Mercury retrograde. So it looks like you've learned your lesson. And you're becoming a better person. You still have work, though, because you're not listening to your intuition. from your player ways and I feel like this is going to open up new opportunities for you you're getting gaining your strength okay I don't think I know any Aquariuses personally mm -mm. I don't think I do no I don't all right, so last but not least, Pisces. Pisces. 
what is the current full moon energy for Pisces? You're working hard on something. Looks like you're about your money. You're in denial about something. Um, justice at the bottom of the deck. There's some 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 deceit going on somewhere. From a king of cups, maybe ten of wands. Someone that's deceived you. Yeah, this this king of uh. You got the Hierophant in, in reverse. So this is this is something, this is against, the divine is against this regardless. Just, I see the justice. Yeah, this nigga's time is up. This is a deceitful, probably a narcissist. The chariot is in reverse. You are no longer moving towards this person. You are moving towards healing. Yeah, you're walking away. This could also be a same sex, uh, same sex two males. Tell me more about this. Yeah, you're standing your ground. You are standing your ground. You are done with all the heartache and pain. You're overcoming obstacles. You see your way out. You see your your your. You see your way out of this and you're moving out of it. Whatever this is, Pisces, you're getting out of it. What's this Ten of Swords? A King of Pentacles. King of Pentacles to clarify this Ten of Swords. The Five of Cups and the Two of Cups. Hmm. It's okay, so the Ten of Swords. There's a Ten of Pentacles here. Someone, okay, someone, okay, so this is you. Pisces, I did say at the beginning that you're focusing on your money now. You are completely cut off. This heartache, this betrayal, being stabbed in your back, this got you on just straight grind mode. You don't give a fuck. You're basically fuck love right now. I only care about money. Aw. That's sad. But I guess, well, I guess as long as you about your money, I mean... Shit, it's a what they say the best revenge is your paper so yeah all right so that was my first all signs um uh, what is this T the take by tori lanes featuring chris brown i don't know what that is but thank you so much for making it through my first all signs with me i hope these readings resonated please don't forget to flip flop whichever resonates if it don't resonate, let it go. Don't hold on to it. Claim what does resonate. Claim what you claim the blessings. Leave the bullshit. Okay. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And also, all my information is in uh, in the description if you want to book a personal reading. I also accept donations on my Cash App. So everything that you need to know will be in the um, in the description below. Thank you and enjoy your full moon. Let me know what rituals you have planned tonight. If you're doing any full moon rituals. I did a, a ritual yesterday and I feel so much better. I was completely drained. That's why I had to cut back on the readings because I was I had no energy. I was completely drained and I figured out what it was. So I did a ritual yesterday and I feel great today. I did what I had to do. So I'm going to be good. But yes, let me know what rituals you're doing tonight, uh, how you're spending your your full moon, and 
Also, how did you spend your Juneteenth? All right.